Hallelujah. Glory to God. This is Prophetic Intercession with Amel. You are welcome. I feel privileged to bring you a prophetic message from God. God says you are the one and they will choose you. You are the one and they will choose you. As a matter of fact, you have been chosen for this privileged position. They don't have a choice but just to follow the rules, just to follow what God has already established. When the Lord gave me this prophetic word, the scenario that came to my mind was the scenario of David. You know, when God told uh, the prophet Samuel to go and anoint a king in the house of J.C. And he went into the house of J.C. And David was in the forest and he's taking care of his father's sheep. And his brothers were all at home. And when when uh, Samuel told um, J.C. to bring all his sons to, to choose the king among them, for one of them to be anointed, he brought all of the sons, and yet none of them was the chosen one. God refused the oil to not pour on any of them to the disappointment of his father because they asked his father, Is this are these all of your sons? And he said, Yes, sidelined in David. But God had already chosen David from the foundations of the year, just like you have been chosen for that particular task. Whether they like you or they don't like you, you are the chosen one. Whether they like you, whether they feel like you, 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 you deserve what is coming or you don't deserve it, God says you have been chosen and the oil can only pour on your head. As contrary to popular opinion, as a matter of fact, what people think about this does not matter. God says you are the right person for this. You are the right person for this honor. You are the right person for that position in that person's life. Hallelujah. I pray for a speedy manifestation of this prophetic word. I rebuke the hand of the devil over your prophecy. It will surely manifest in the mighty name of Jesus. May the Lord bless you, keep you, cause his face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.